Hello, everybody. Welcome back to another edition of Matchbox Marks Diecast Restorations. So this project, I'm taking on a custom here. Uh, I'm going to pay homage to John Deere. John Deere is an American icon uh, tractor maker. So I sourced these decals from eBay. So I got plenty to pick from. So I'm going to take this Dodge Ram truck. It's a might. It's a Maisto, and Maisto actually has pretty good units. So there it is. It's got cool tires on it. So I'm going to customize this to John Deere. Of course, uh, John Deere's colors are green and yellow. So there's the first one. And the next one are a couple matchboxes. So normally I don't ever, ever customize uh, matchboxes, but this time might uh, do this these two tractors I've got so this tractor uh, wheels are in pretty rough shape so this one here is the Ford tractor see if I can get a number on there I might have to clean it up and then get a number so there's that one can't really read the number and then this little jobby here has no tires so, I don't know if I'm going to source the tires or just use O-rings. Uh, obviously, uh, getting tires with tread would be a lot better. So, this one right here, I don't know what I'm going to do yet. If I'm going to restore this or just customize it. Uh, since I'm getting O-rings to replace the tires, I'll probably uh, customize it too. So, uh, that one will probably be a custom. And this one will probably be a restoration. So... Anyway, so there you have it. Uh, stay tuned as we pay homage to John Deere. All right, so I took the truck and the tractors apart. So uh, these were really hard to get off. Uh, so I think what I'm going to do besides cleaning these axles is I might ream these out just a little bit so they can go on a little bit uh, smoother. And here's the other tractor. A really simple unit. We got the body. We got the, the engine area. And the little seat. And the tires. I don't know if these tires are meant to be so wobbly. I don't know. Uh, I have to do some investigating. And here's the uh, Dodge Ram truck. Cool interior, like I say, it's like new, and I really like the tires actually. Even though this is uh, not the not the most expensive casting, but I do like the tires, so I'm gonna keep those. And this is the front end, uh, which it was kind of strange. It was held on there by the post, so I guess it'll be easy for me to uh, detail this. All right. So let me get these to the stripper and stay tuned. All right, so I wanted to do an update on the tractor. So actually I was looking at this and I noticed on the bottom it had two more rivets. So this uh, tractor came apart in three uh, pieces. So it'll be easier for me to paint this. So obviously I'm gonna do it in uh, Three different colors yellow green and black uh so yeah i'm anxious to see how this will turn out so stay tuned all right so here is the dodge ram and the tractors after being uh stripped of the paint and soaked in an alcohol bath so <clears throat> hopefully the paint will stick to the castings better so me. There's the engine. Look at all that detail. It's amazing. Well, I guess I missed some paint right there. Huh. Thought I got it all. And then here's the other Ford tractor. There we go. All right. I'm going to take these and get them primed up. Stay tuned. All right, so I have all the uh, tractors and the John Deere Dodge Ram truck ready to be reassembled. 
uh, I did have to wait, or I had to order the tires for the little tractor, so uh, I'm going to put most of them together the best I can and then wait for the tires to come in and do the final reveal. So stay tuned. All right, it is time for my final reveal for my uh, couple tractors and John Deere custom truck. So this was my restoration and Ford tractor. And didn't really do anything but paint it. Didn't do anything with the wheels. I just kind of kept the wheels the way they were. And let's see what we got here. Oh, there's the number. Let me see if I can get my camera to focus. Uh, number 46. So... Actually came out pretty decent. Paint looks pretty close. There's that one. And here is my custom John Deere. So took it all apart. This comes in like three different pieces. So I finally got my tires in today from Recover Toy. And the front tires actually were too big. So I had to use my O-rings that I've used on other models. I think I used them on the Unimog uh, restoration fleet. So, uh, yeah, green and yellow. John Deere. And last but not least, I think this came out pretty good. My uh, Dodge Ram uh, John Deere Special. So, this one, I actually took out the rims and I painted them green. And got my John Deere decals, painted the roof green, which was kind of hard to do. It's really hard for me to do the two tones. So there you have it. Uh, an homage to John Deere, an American icon. So if you like this video, uh, hit the like button, subscribe, leave a comment, all that good jazz. And uh, hopefully everybody is being safe from this coronavirus. Uh, I'm, I'm a teacher, so we're actually closed the next two weeks. So that'll give me a chance to do some, uh, do some models. So all right, until the next one, stay safe.